We're going to be looking at a four-unit apartment building for my clients, Jerry and Lisa. Let's dive in. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey folks, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show. I'm your host, James Wise, and this is the show on Holton Wise TV where we work together one-on-one. -on -one. Right now, I'm working with Jerry and Lisa. This is the third video I've done for you folks today because you guys have to identify at least $400,000 worth of real estate uh, for a 1031 exchange you're doing, right? And just a quick little recap on you folks. Uh, you're longtime seasoned investors, right? You've been in the game for 17 years. You've owned rentals since 2003, right? So you come to Holton Wise. You don't necessarily need uh, a ton of training or education or advice uh, on the business itself, right? You're coming to us for our boots on the ground, for our experience in the Cleveland market, for the fact that after we close on these properties, we can handle your property management, uh, your property management, your maintenance, your insurance, Insurance, title insurance, all kinds of insurance, right? We got all the insurances, folks. Uh, we can handle the whole thing, right? We could do that stuff. We could unclog your toilets, show the units to your tenants, yada, yada, right? We got the one-stop shop for you. But first, it starts with identifying the properties. And I gave you two, right? At first, I gave you a quad in Lakewood, which was my favorite. Then I gave you a triplex in Cleveland Heights. That was my second favorite. This is my third favorite, right? If you could buy all three... I would say, heck, buy all three. But if you could only buy one, first I'd do the quad in Lakewood. Then I would do the triplex in Cleveland Heights. This would be my fallback option. It's been on the market for 41 days. 11709 Nelson Court, Lakewood, listed at two and a quarter. I feel this price is too high, okay? I think two and a quarter is too high for this one. I want to try to pick it up for you guys for 185000 Now, the reason that this quad is worth so much less than the other quad, number one, it's a little bit further east, okay? I told you guys in that video, as far as Lakewoods goes, the, f the further west you go, right, the higher the rents, the nicer the properties, the nicer the neighborhood. It turns into like an A-class neighborhood eventually, okay? So the further east you are, the lower quality uh, you're going to get. Now, that's not to say it's like low quality, right? You're still in Lakewood, which is probably, in my opinion, the most high demand rental neighborhood in the in the whole Cleveland market, right? So <laughs> when I say like the quality goes down, I want you to think you're buying in the ghetto. You're still in Lakewood, so you're still doing really, really well. Uh, but I'm just explaining to you why this particular quad is going to be worth so much less and then other than that what we have here folks we have four one bedroom units right the other one was two bedroom units so much higher demand uh, we have four one bedroom units here bringing in 2140 a month or 25,680 a year cool thing though is we could get the market rents on each of these units up to about 600 so no uh, that these are below market rents, right? So the actual long-term cash flow will look even better than the numbers I'm going to provide for you today because I just did the numbers based upon what you currently have, okay? So with what you currently have, 25680 comes in. I anticipate you guys spending 15 and a half of that, leaving us with a cash flow of 10188 if we are able to work the sellers down to the particular price point that I would like to do, the 185, that's going to result in a 5.5 cap. You only need to put down 46250 of your own cash, giving you guys a very solid and respectable 6.8% cash on cash return. As far as what the building looks like, just a classic classic uh old century old building there brick all right we got you know just pretty pretty low key nothing high end right we don't have an extremely high end renovation done here like we just did in the cleveland heights building right you see we got the same color trim as we do walls right so if you do want to increase those rents down the road we're going to want to put a higher level of finish into these units right you got 
pretty small kitchens here. Uh, so an upgrade on these kitchens wouldn't be too much money to bring in a higher class of tenant, a higher rent roll. Are you a lender? If so, Holton Wise is looking to partner with you. If you're licensed in all 50 states, go to HoltonWise.com. Click the digital media tab to advertise on Holton Wise TV today. And uh, what we also have is we have four separate hot water tanks, four separate furnaces. Uh, those are anticipated to be mid to end of life. As far as the roof goes, same situation here as we had with the previous quad in Lakewood. Uh, it's a flat rubberized roof. Uh, it's been maintained as we are told. However, what we're going to want to do is if you guys do move forward with an offer on this particular property, we're going to want to have the inspector actually get up there and check it out for himself, right? Trust but verify that's what's important in this business but i probably don't need to tell you guys that since you've been in the game for 17 years right so these are the three buildings that i found for you guys you wanted to identify at least four hundred thousand dollars worth of real estate for your 1031 and you wanted to do it in as few buildings as possible so i wanted to comb through uh, you know, the three and the four unit buildings in the Cleveland market because we have a very low inventory of those. I believe uh, three and four unit buildings on the market as I was looking for you guys to do these videos for you. I think we only had in the areas you guys had said you wanted to work in, the C and B class neighborhoods. I think we only had like a total of nine of them on the market, right? So these were definitely the three best. And then I ranked them in order uh, in which I would take them down personally, right? First being the Lakewood Quad, then the Cleveland Heights Triplex, and then this would be my fallback, the second Lakewood Quad, which is what I would consider to be the lowest end of all the buildings, right? So all three of these uh, videos have been sent to you guys in a private link. Let us know your feedback. Let us know which buildings you want to make offers on. We will submit those offers on your behalf, start negotiating with the sellers. If we secure a contract, get things under contract, we will help you schedule home inspectors to get in there. We have home inspector referrals if you want them. If you want to use anyone else, that's totally fine with us. The goal is to be as transparent as possible, make it as arm's length of a transaction as possible right so if you have your own inspector that you found and i've never heard of them that's totally fine if you trust that person that's great i want you guys to get as much information as you possibly can on these buildings before you make the final decision to move forward or not if for some reason all three of these quads or i'm sorry all three of the two of two are quads one's a triplex if for some reason all three of these buildings are not what you guys were looking for i'm going to need you guys to provide me some feedback so i can go back to the drawing board and uh, look for some different things right we've pretty much exhausted all the triplex and uh, quad inventory here there's nothing else on the market Market today as I talk to you that will be a better fit for you than these as far as that goes so if you'd like to start looking into uh, cheaper properties we can start looking at the duplexes and single-family homes but remember it's gonna take you more individual buildings uh, to exhaust the identification of four hundred thousand dollars worth of real estate that is it for today's show for everybody else out there who's watching this and is interested in possibly investing in the Cleveland market and working with our team, you guys can go ahead and send an email to sales at holtonwise.com. Go ahead and include your phone number. My team will give you a call. We will get all the information about you, just like we've done with Jerry and Lisa. Figure out what makes you tick. Figure out what your goals are. See what your experience level is. See what you want from us. Uh, what we can help you accomplish, and we can get started working together. If you're not ready for that just yet, what I think you need to do is smash that subscribe button and continue watching the various other free educational content that we've put out here on Holton Wise TV because we give you guys the good, the bad, and the ugly when it comes to real estate investing. That's all I've got for today's show. As always, I'm James Wise, and Holton Wise is real estate investing made easy. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.